Lloyd Klein is my real name, absolutely. It was a big deal to be the head designer of Madame Grey, a legendary designer. It's impressive, it's important. That did give me a lot of uh, confidence. When she died, I decided to leave the house and to continue on my own. I'm uh, always in a dream, but I am someone that works non-stop. It was a question of uh, life or death, and uh, we didn't know if I would come back. I will never uh, accomplish uh, enough. I am all about fashion, the sleep fashion, I dream fashion. I love Los Angeles. I love the fact that I can meet all the celebrities every day, which is important. Actually, the Hayden Pantiers and the Marissa Millers, and they, they definitely respect what I do. They respect the, the, the clothes, they respect the dress. They don't try to change it. The icons do. Well, the icons have a few more bumps and bulges than uh, some of the... Don't audience. talk like that. Movie stars come here regularly. They just ring the front doorbell and, oh my God, here's Madonna or Paul Abdul. I mean, they're all coming to see us. It's pretty cool. Miss Cole, when you came out in that dress and I saw you come out, I was watching the TV, and I saw Natalie Cole in that beautiful, amazing, with this beautiful, amazing voice coming in that little something. So, so, the I next mean, day. something had to give. My name <laughs> is John Arguez, and I'm president of Lloyd Klein. That's the fade in order. Lloyd's got an appointment in like an hour, and we get to get the whole fitting done. So you guys hurry a little bit faster. There's four more dresses. What it means to be the president of Lloyd Klein is everything but design. They're like $4,000 each embroidery. We don't talk about money. Well, I know you Obviously. don't like to talk about money, but sometimes we have no, to talk about money. I never count, so I don't know. I know you don't count. A lot of challenges in running a business. Celebrities borrow, borrow, take, 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 take. We're one of the very few. Buy a little, borrow a little, buy a little. And that's important because, you know, we're all in business. No, it's true. So you can't I keep really doing for free. Continue. As a matter of fact, I'm going to give you a check today. No. <laughs> Maybe some of the most difficult things of dealing with Lloyd is that he's a perfectionist. No, listen to me. When you put your hand, slowly, mm -hmm. you know, it's fragile. Sometimes, you know, we've done shows and he wants the, the sky to be purple. And I'm like, well, if the sky can't be purple, the sky is blue. And so... But at the end, it is purple. He likes things to be beautiful. If you're not able to be sensitive when you look at the flower and you see those perfect colors, or you, you look at the sky and you see a sun that is hitting on you, you will not be able to understand fashion. It's really, really, really difficult to be around sometimes. He has really, really high standards. So I know. What? She's got makeup all like here and all through that the whole back. And she's picking it up in like four hours. Who put the makeup on you? I didn't try to dress. She didn't use the dress. Look at me. Don't mess with him when he's working on a collection. You don't want to bring him any problems that aren't related specifically with the thing he's doing because um, all hell will break loose. We have 15 minutes to show the collection and we have 2,000 people in the room and we've worked and for And $250,000 to $500,000 going out the door for that 15 minutes. 15 minutes the day off. A day off? The collection we we're talking about. Oh, on top of that. And the collection is always the most important thing, so that's... That goes above everything else. Mr. Klein wants to see this upstairs. This is for the next collection. Richard, I love the front very much. God, you couldn't ask for a better um, assistant for Lloyd because Lloyd would prefer to work in silence at all times. Um, it's just kind of where he can really get the most work done. And because Richard's deaf and he can't communicate really through speaking, it's perfect because he doesn't hear any comments that would 
set him off. It's my sketch. We don't care about what he does. Okay. Next God, he cannot hear me. And he gets it. He's much more perceptive to uh, direction and to understanding the subtleties that Lloyd points out for him. Guyana, come here. Bravo. <laughs> Guyana is a uh, head seamstress. She's from Russia. And uh, she says, you know, John, the beautiful thing with me is I can make sweater for spider. I fit perfectly. And she does. This is good. It's not if he likes it or not. I love that. It's when he loves it or not. If I ask Tina to do something in a certain way, it's done that same way until told differently every day, day in and day out. She's organized, she's systematic, she's thorough, and she holds the keys to my business. In Who do you see in that, in that uh... Who do I see in this dress? Um, you want Nicole, Nicole Kidman? Kidman? <laughs> ah, Tammy's amazing. I'm not gonna say she's my Jewish mother because she's not old enough to be my Jewish mother. She's my Jewish sister. I like to listen to her opinion. She's a, she has a, a good eye. <laughs> because if I don't like it, maybe it's a sign that someone else may, may not like it. Usually I do beautiful things. I have an amazing staff. All of them are amazing. They're wonderful to work with. But there is a minimum required. I want to quit the business all the time. Tell her not to call me anymore, John. Okay, okay, okay. I, why should I do that? Stop it. No. Okay. That's what I really don't want. If we weren't friends, Lloyd, I don't know if uh, I could handle what you usually put me through. Do you like it? John? Yeah. No, no, no. I don't, I don't know. Don't look at me like you're gonna die and nothing's <laughs> gonna know. happen to you. No, let, I don't want to do it. No, I just need some privacy. Please, can I have the privacy? We, almost every day, are in some sort of an argument. No, wait a minute. I ask you to do this um, flake black. Black, it has to be here in the middle. I know, that's where so, it's supposed to go. Not on the whole building. I know that. It, it, it was almost saying, don't feed the turtles. So they think this is the house of don't feed the turtles, you know? <laughs> so this is not OK. I know that. Find a solution. I've been asking you. I know, but the thing is, is that people are going to sit on the wall. But it is not they, private. But, but it's, it's not public. a public garden. It is no, public. It's not. It's not. They were giving the cornflakes and popcorn I to know. the turtles. Which if you is. want to have a... Uh, <laughs> giant turtles with popcorn. The turtles, turtles are not going to get fat. This is okay with me, but not, you know. Then we cannot dress those turtles anymore. <laughs> you know? Dress the turtles. Voila. Nice. I'm not afraid to take risks. As long as, it, uh, as long as we stay elegant. If we can have that on daily basis, this is fantastic. That's what we say, actually, after every one of our fights. Next day, ah, turn the page. That you can say that in English, turn the, pa yeah, turn the it page. It is English. It is English. Yeah. Turn the page. Tourne la page. Tourne la page. That's French. Mm -hmm.